I'm Matt here from Tucker Barbecues. Today we're going to talk about the Tucker Rotisserie Kit and how to install it. With our rotisserie kit, you can turn your GT, GTR and R-Class barbecue into a cooking rotisserie machine. Whether you're craving a succulent roast chicken or a leg of pork or anything you can roast, you can do that on the Tucker Rotisserie Kit. Simply load up your favorite food onto the rotisserie and just watch it rotate as it cooks your favorite food. Not only that, for something extra with a rotisserie kit, you can add a charcoal tray to the GT, GTR, or the R-Class Tucker barbecues just for that extra flavor with your rotisserie. Now let's see how we can set it up onto the barbecue. When you buy the Tucker rotisserie, it comes with a rod, a motor, a pair of prongs, motor bracket, counterweight, securing bush, and some nuts and bolts. To set it up, you need the roasting hood. If you've got the flat lid on your Tucker barbecue instead of the roasting hood, you can come to one of our Tucker stores and pick up a roasting hood. Once you have the hood ready, remove the rear stainless steel cooking shelf from inside the hood. Attach the motor bracket to the roasting hood by opening the hood and using the nuts and bolts provided to secure the bracket in place. Then simply slide the rotisserie motor down over the top of the locating forks on the bracket. When you're ready to cook, take off the prong and counterweight from the end of the rod that would attach to the motor. Pierce the food you're about to cook through the rod. Try to have the food as center as possible to avoid unnecessary strain and stress on the rotisserie motor. Now squash the skewer prongs together to keep the meat in place and lock the prongs by tightening the wing nuts on each prong and put the counterweight back on. Make sure you have the rod looking like this. Insert the skewer rod into the roasting hood and adjust the securing bush so the groove of the bush sits inside panel of the hood, keeping the rod secure in place. The rod has a slot notched for older hood models. Adjust the counterweight so that the weight is evenly balanced as possible by positioning the counterweight opposite to the heaviest side of the meat. Tighten the weight in place. Finally, turn on the motor and observe as it turns. If you hear the motor straining at different positions of rotation, the meat and counterweight might require repositioning. That's all folks, now thanks for watching and enjoy your Tucker Rotisserie Kit.